in this video i'm going to be showing you how to run google ads in nigeria the best way for you to be able to run google search ads in nigeria and how you can be able to verify your google ads account i leave a particular way by which you can be able to contact me and by so doing you can be able to solve all these google ads ban issues okay so if you're new to this video don't forget to subscribe turn on the bell notification icon and hit the like button so that youtube can be able to show people who need help just like you this is your own way of doing charity let's get straight into it without further ado of course you should go to ads.google.com for you to be able to you know once you go here then you actually click on sign in or start now do you understand now so once you do that you create your ads account and then you actually get into your dashboard right here and also when i go to the notification icon here you can see thanks for ver verifying the verified advertiser name and location each of these account will now appear so now if in case you don't know google ads require you to verify your google ads account do you understand and to verify your google ads account is not it's not a child's play do you understand so i do help people in guiding them in this process do you understand and i have seen a lot of videos on youtube of people saying uh, how to pay for google ads in naira how to pay for google ads in whatever whatever listen to me very carefully uh you might be able to you know use the step some of this guide and get a google ads account but note that this google ads account that you are getting to pay in naira is not actually your own because these people are actually creating a google ads account on behalf of you and should in case that google ads account gets banned your fifty thousand naira which you pay them don't go with that and you can and whenever you want to run ads again do you understand maybe probably you survive it then you know they will tell you to pay another fifty thousand they get you another ads account and you get what i'm saying so it's better to verify your ads account because the ad account that you are buying in Nera, you are not actually verifying it so you know these are no piece do you understand you can contact me at the with the number on whatsapp at the end of this video i will show you how to create a verified google ads account and it's not free do you understand but me i will tell you do you understand uh -huh. so let's get straight into it without further ado so the next thing i'm going to do right now we on new campaign so once i click on new campaign right now you're going to see what's your campaign objective of course you want to create google search ads okay whereby your adverts will show at the top of google who are searching for the keywords of your advertisement so i'm just going to click on website traffic we want to get website traffic to our landing page or website so you click on the website traffic click on add go here and probably add a go do you understand to your account maybe continue okay now once you click on continue then the next thing you want to do right now you're going to click on search get in front of high intent customers at the right time on google search so once you do that you want to paste your website url okay here okay the link you want to direct people to so i'm just going to get that and paste it in right here of the landing name is there already you can edit it yourself do right now is click on continue so once i click on continue the next page is actually going to load and you're going to see something like very bidding what do you want to focus on so i'm just going to click on it and i'm going to click on clicks okay so i want people to click to my website okay so for a starter just choose clicks to avoid different kind of complications okay so you're going to see something like set a maximum cost per bid limit just leave it like that do you understand let them suggest it automatically and the next thing you're going to do right now is you are going to click you are going to click on next okay so let's click on next and the next thing you want to do right now is number one remember that we want to we want to run these ads only on google search okay we want people who are searching for the products or services we are trying to sell do you understand on google and um, not people to actually see the picture of our ad on just random blog website so we are just going to leave the one of search network leave it ticked on like this blue okay include google search patterns which is google search search networks okay and tick off this display network okay so once you tick it off then 
<clears throat> your ad is just going to show on Google search go down and you're going to see something like use display expansion don't ever click on it because this is actually just going to distribute your ads to different kind of blog websites you want to do strictly Google search ads okay let's go so you're going to go to that location then when you get to that location you choose the location you want you can see beneath it Nigeria which I have okay so whichever location you want to do you can just click on enter another location and input the name of the location you want to target here if i say united states you can see it here you understand so for mine you can choose two or more so for mine i'm just going to choose nigeria do you understand okay so the next thing i'm going to do right now is i'm going to scroll down then in the language you can see it english is what we speak here in nigeria even though we have some other native language so english is the you know normal general language for everybody so you're going to select english type it in here you can see it is selected here so whichever country you want to target do you understand just make sure that you select their native language the general language they speak there do you understand so people can understand your ads so you're going to see something like audience segments let me see this audience segment just leave it like that do you understand fold it don't do anything in this place do you understand so don't do anything in that audience segment because we are going to be targeting using keyword people who are actually searching an actual keyword and that will match your adverts and that will trigger your ads to show on google ads google search network so go down then you are going to click on more settings let's check it out you're going to see ad rotation okay start and end date do you understand so once you click on this then this will determine when you want your advert to start you can see january to 2024 so if i want it to start january 9 or january 3 january 4 any date you understand that is when the advert is going to start and the end date if i click on none that means you are not setting an end date for your advert to stop do you understand so uh and if i click on if i want to select an end date if i click on this and i click on select a date do you understand i'll be able to select an end date for it do you understand so let me just click on none just to gather social proof it's your own taste do you understand so when we click on more settings let's just check this out okay there is nothing to do here so the next thing you want to do right now is you want to click on next okay so sometimes they will have suggested some keywords in this box you have below do you understand so we are going to be just be doing some little uh you know thing here about this keyword targeting now i won't you know this keyword i want to use is just an example to what i offer do you understand I'm a, I'm a digital marketing consultant so if you i will advise you that if you want a correct targeting for your particular business or products on google search ads just type something to me like i need the targeting for google search ads please help me just send that to this number you see on the screen um below or oh, sorry on the screen do you understand or that's in the link in the description box and i'll be able to help you with that it's not free but i will craft out an audience or, or craft out a keyword that will perfectly match your business do you understand so that is the heart of your advice if you get it wrong you're going to waste a lot of money so this is it this is the website then do you understand this is the link to my website so you're going to, just going to see something like uh, enter keyword so you know the particular product that you are selling so for my own i'll just say okay maybe uh i'm into digital marketing i might just say maybe okay what what product do i offer let me just think let me think let me think let me think let me think i could just say okay google ads services okay this is one keyword for me and when we see it let's see how many you know xtbit is actually going to bring you can see it's bringing around weekly clicks 2458 clicks uh weekly cost 151 dollar don't worry we are going we are still going to adjust this the money we want to spend per day which is actually going to bring this weekly whatever average cpc 0 0.06 that is 0 0.06 cent so let me just try and type in another thing i could just see maybe facebook ads facebook ads agency okay so you know you can type in many keywords you can see average cost per click 
is reduced to 0 0.03 you understand weekly cost is 56 dollar you know it's getting some uh, but uh, you know if you check this below you're going to see something like uh if you use just this keyword like this without putting any punctuation mark you're going to see something like this just broad match so you could just go and get people who just search for google or just search for ads or just search for services or just search for facebook ads facebook ads facebook agency so this advert can just be everywhere do you understand so i want people who are actually searching for these full keywords google ad services who search for it on google and my advert will just pop up to them immediately do you understand the full keyword so you're going to see something like it like this thing exact match this is what i'm going to be using you're going to see something like keyword okay so i'm just going to put this box bracket this this box bracket you can see the sign here and i'm going to put it in the front and at the back this is it okay the front and at the back so let me just see the estimate is going to bring because it is more precise here it means that you can see weekly clicks 943 okay average cost per click is 0 0.06 now this kind of targeting by which you put that box bracket in front of those keywords anybody who search for google my advert will not show up anybody who just search for google as my advert will not show up or facebook ads whatever but they must search for this google ad services my advert will show up facebook ads agency my advert will show up you understand so let me just use this tool then i'll just go down then once i get down you're going to get to that uh you know place by which uh you're actually going to be setting your ads do you understand okay so here is my final url and you're going to scroll down a bit then you're going to see something like um display path so i could just type in uh you know my name and put home here okay just for it to show in this ad preview on google do you understand when people search for it okay so you're going to see it here then the next thing i'm actually going to do right now is i'm just going to scroll down and you can see the keywords they are actually suggesting here you if you check out that our targeting we actually included facebook ad services google ad services now these people actually told us that the best thing we can do is to actually include these keywords in our headlines for us to get a very accurate result so as you can see right now you're going to see that this thing has been ticked green facebook ad services google ad services why because we've been able to use it in the we've been able to use these keywords we use in our ads targeting do you understand for the keyword targeting in our you know title and description you're going to see this thing searches in the last Saturday. you are using these keywords in your headlines okay you're going to see the first headline best facebook ad best facebook ad services solution to the solution to google ads issues okay certified media advertiser okay and uh, when i go down this like i said these are all example okay so when i go down to that description you're going to see io is marketing offers a wide range of solutions to all social media advertising issues be it google ad services facebook ad services youtube ads tiktok ads and more okay and i said we are here for you now like i said this is just an example just to make this video short and precise to the point now as for this business name do you understand we could just click on this plus icon and uh, i'm just going to you know input a business name for it which i'm going to say io is marketing okay so once i do this and i'll click on apply and you're going to see my business name showing at the top of the google search ads you're going to see it io is marketing okay so that is that then i'm just going to go down what is then the business logo you know we might decide to add a logo just for this video i'm not going to do anything just click on this logo select the picture site links you can click on that site links button to add some site links to your you know uh to your advert okay whereby people can click again to go to but you know simplicity beats all do you understand so we have a call out 
if you click on call out you have some other type of you know section you can even put here do you understand to run your advert so for this i'm just going to click on you know i'm just going to click on done do you understand you don't need to put anything here so i'm just going to click on done and once i click on done this is the preview of the ad do you understand then the next thing i'm going to click on is next let's click on next right now so now you are going to get to the budget section which says select the average you want to spend each day do you understand so uh for instance if you want to spend 13 dollars you could click it here but you are going to see a particular recommended average daily budget which is 10 dollars 19 uh 10 dollars 96 cent do you understand so if you choose this this is just what it is going to give us weekly okay weekly clicks is going to be 1276 clicks and uh, with the average cpc cost per click of 0 0.06 cent the weekly cost is going to be 76 dollars 74 cent now if you say maybe you want to go below that do you understand though i used to tell people to go with the average daily budget which is recommended you know google know its platform so it knows its thing so if you click on set a custom budget here do you understand you could choose maybe you want to use maybe uh let's just say five dollar daily and if you click on this custom budget five dollar daily they are going to give you that okay you are going to be getting an average of 865 clicks per week with 0 0.04 cent and 34 dollars 97 cent you can also see it here do you understand so let's just leave it in that five dollars okay and uh let's go down and uh, you're going to see your budget is lower than other advertisers budget which may affect performance try raising it to at least ten dollars 96 cents per day so that's why i say you should use the recommended but if you don't want to use the recommended you can just go straight with it like that do you understand so that's that let's click on next do you understand we actually said here and if we click on so let's click on publish cam and this is publishing right now okay this is publishing right now and once it's published you are going to see 